guys welcome back to my channel my name is Onibudo Rimui so if you are new here like subscribe and share for others don't also forget to turn on your notification button today i'll be interviewing my colleagues and then ask them what they feel about the course and then their um thoughts about funding investing so i don't know what to say ah Hi guys, welcome back. I'm here with Rukaya. What do you feel about studying mass communication? What do you think? What do you feel? What have you learned so far? Actually, first of all, I don't like mass com generally, but I don't have choice that's great. But ever since I've been involved in university, mass com has been a great joy to me because in the aspect of the practical the lecturers and everything, the way they teach and everything. It's really inspired me like, oh, wow, mass communication is hmm, dope, like, it's good. The practical alone is, ah, uh, um, uh, it's very, very good, very good, very good. Okay, so, Rukaya, what do you think about mass communication lecturers in our school, in Fountain University? Uh, mass com lecturers, shout out to them because i'm very very glad like they are very very good it's not that they only teach on the subject you know or the topic you know they only talk about life lifestyle and everything the way your religion your greetings and everything and i've actually watched all mass come students their greetings like all of them the way they greet their respect so it's very very reciprocal but everybody there, there's no way no way see most come to that there we are great yeah. yes no yeah, doubt we are no great who is your favorite lecturer in mass communication fountain university first the person okay so there are many you said first so first two. First two. and first two. and mr Kin today mr Kin today okay so guys you've listened to rukoya You've had uh, talked about what she what she feels about studying mass communication, not only in Fountain University and other schools also, and then what she has learned so far. And her favorite lecturer, lecturers in Fountain University. So, bye. Bye. Hear yeah, it. Hola, 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 Tom. So, hola, Tom. What do you think about Fountain University? Fountain University is a great school, a great school for your children, mm -hmm. and it doesn't just teach us about academics alone, mm -hmm. it, it let us know more about our religion, mm -hmm. basically Islam, because it's an Islamic school. As okay. you can see, we are both coming out it, so it requires us to dress decently and modestly, and also our lecturers also they purchase the school in a way that you will love to even want your junior ones to come and the school environment is a conducive one is encouraging is delighting Martin is just the great school it's just the best but do you know you are a christian so how do you feel as a christian in a faith-based school most especially like facing the islamic like more specific on islam well, that's a good question and a very big one. It doesn't matter actually. So far, I know I'm in a Muslim school. Doesn't mean I should. I know I'm a Christian. Yes, I still believe in my religion and I'm still in my religion. But then again, ever since I entered Fountain, individual as myself alone, I've learned some kind of like some interesting ways to dress decently and still rock it, and you know. It actually like feels nice to cover your head almost all the time. It feels nice. Okay. It feels decent. More enlightening. And... So, Hi. as a mass comm student now, mm -hmm. what do you think about mass comm lecturers? For somebody coming to Fountain University and then wanting to like study mass communication. So, what do you think about mass comm lecturers? Okay, mass comm lecturers. First, I'd like to appreciate every single one of our lecturers mm -hmm. they are great teachers and amazing people not just teachers alone they don't just enlighten us academically they give us the moral some moral lessons that they think we should like have mm -hmm. some of us already have them and some of us don't so we learn academically and both morally and also they are good people they 
they enlighten us in ways that students should be enlightened. They don't just they go they, when in classes. For example, let me use Doctor Sonny as an example. My respect to him. He's a very good man, a good father, a good individual, and also an amazing lecturer. So when he teaches in class, he explains in a way that even the dumbest in this world would understand to yeah, get. Yeah. Uh, he breaks things down. Yeah. If he uses big English, he breaks it down in a way that you can guess, that you can understand. To get kind of thing. He's a very good person. So oh. else, my, my guess here is my guess here is that Dr. Sonny is your favorite lecturer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yes, yes sir. So thank you very much. Thank you guys for watching. Um, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Also, comment what you feel, feel like. Much content you want to be seen on this channel. And also, shout out to my friends, Rukoya and Olaito, for saying So, what do you think?